Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna teach you how to bring the newly added weapon Dark Wand from Hell Raid to the main game. So it's very simple. If you have done the Fire Wand trick earlier then this should be very easy for you. But if this is your first time playing Hell Raid then you need to finish the story mode of Hell Raid and follow my other video for which I will have the link in the description. In that video I'll be showing you how to get the Fire Wand. So if you want to use the Dark Wand you will first need to unlock a Fire Wand. Also guys we're so close to 100k so do consider subscribing as I post daily Dying Light and Dying light to content on this channel. Now coming back to the video, if you're done getting the fire wand, you can just simply start your game and the moment you enter in a hell raid, Lucius will talk to you automatically and the moment he stops talking, there will be a portal that will spawn right behind you. Do not enter the red portal, this is the portal that spawns right behind you, watch the video for the reference. Now enter the portal and follow the quest and disrupt the ritual and pick up the skull. By the way, if you want the full walkthrough on this, let me know in the comments. Alright, so the moment you survive the ambush and pick the skull, you have finished the quest. Now you can enter the portal and you will again meet Lucius. Now Lucius will again say something, let him finish his talk and then enter the portal again that spawns right behind you. Same place where it spawned before. Now in this quest you will need to hunt down Anit's demon aka Lord Esmeralda. The quest can take about 30 minutes and you will need to fight so many zombies before that but at the end when you meet the demon you need to be sure that you are prepared. So before you fight him make sure you bring a bow, an arrow, some explosives and enough medicates. This fight might look easy at first but as soon as he start spawning ghosts, they're gonna do a lot of damage. And since they spawn higher number, they can actually stack their damage and you can die instantly. But hey, there's a good news. These ghosts will actually die in one hit and just in case if you end up dying, well you can just respawn and continue the fight again. It's that easy. By the way, a tip. If you wear the Vancouver outfit, you can throw your weapon at him and it will come back to you. This was really helpful for me since I could hit him from a far distance without getting hit. But hey, once you kill the demon, the Lord Asmerod, well, you can search his body and that will give you the Dark Wand. Now, go and place the skull and the skull will get destroyed and it's over. You have successfully done the whole thing, the quest is completed. Now you will return back to Lucius again. After coming back, you need to make sure your inventory is full and fully stacked. So you can no longer pick any weapon. Also, make sure you have the Dark Wand equipped while having your inventory full. And once you're back in slums, if you did everything right, you should have the Dark Wand weapon in your stash. So go ahead, equip that and use it in the main game. Enjoy, but remember it's kind of buggy here in the main game. So first of all, you can die easily if you hit a wall or something with this. Or sometimes the wand will make weird noises, like literally loud noises. And sometimes you can climb up on an invisible wall while shooting and drop kicking all together. Alright guys, that's it. So enjoy and thank you for watching. Come here. Special deal for you.